we're kind of like an, an eclectic mix of vintage items, um, antiques, um, probably from you know anything from mid 1800s all the way up into the 1980s. You can find a little bit of anything. Um, you know, a lot of people will say it's man cave, but we also have items. Um, up for, for kids um, of all ages, adults. We do a lot of gas and oil, porcelain signs, coin-op vending items, trains, um, a lot of paper advertising, craft items. We try to be very competitive in the market. Um, a lot of other stores, you know, price things um, the old way through books and value, you know, through value price books, but um, everything we do, everything we buy or sell is priced on the mark, the current market of selling. And what I mean by that is the online selling, because online is such a large presence nowadays that we have to base it on what we see at um, eBay, Etsy, um, online auctions. Um, and those are what people are actually paying for those type of things. So we want to price our stuff just a hair below what they're going for so we can rotate our inventory because we have more inventory than our store can hold. And we also sell on eBay and we sell on Etsy and we sell on Facebook market. We sell pretty much anywhere we can. Um, we, I'd say the majority of our items though are on our site or in our store. We get calls almost every day um, from our website. Um, people find us online very easy and um, we have a lot of locals who bring, th bring items in that, um, that they want to sell. I take old carburetors, automotive carburetors, um, old gas torches, gas um, meters. I've taken old um, radiant heaters, gas heaters, gas fireplace inserts, and I turn them into um, table lamps, floor lamps. Um, they, they have that kind of industrial look, but I keep a, I do a hand patina on a lot of them. I've always loved vintage items. Um, and you know, as far as the store, um, I mean, this is my passion. Um, I, you know, I started this as a hobby, and it was a hobby that turned into a website that grew into the store. Um, so it's been probably 12 years now, and the store has been open eight years. Um, and every year it just gets bigger and better.